I hope you came hungry. I mean really hungry. It's Gourmet Gents. It's like in its 20th year here in Atlanta and this is where the men cook for the women and they raise a lot of money to help mentor young women in the community. Well let's find out. Let's strap on our aprons men and find out if real men can cook. Tell us about this event. Well, Khan, it's great to have you back with us this year. This is our 21st annual Gourmet Gen, sponsored by the National Coalition of 100 Black Women, Metropolitan Atlanta Chapter. I'm the president, and it's delighted to have you here. All the proceeds of the Gridiron Experience go to our Teens on the Move program. We're raising money to have a holistic approach to make sure that we inspire and mentor and motivate them to be our future. Tell us about your chefs this year. They've worked extra hard. Oh my goodness, everything from delectable desserts to inspiring appetizers. It's a great experience and con having you here just topped it off. <laughs> we love your voice on 107.5 but it was important for you to be here. Well you know it's very important for me to be here because I'm always in give back mode. I like to give back to the community and the coalition of 100 black women are giving back, bringing some teens in, teaching them some life skills. So it's a great event, it's a fun event, lots of energy, lots of scenery, lots of food. It's a great event. Brenda, what's the best part about being a judge? Are you kidding me? Eating! <laughs> I mean, it's a tough job, but somebody has to do it, right? I enjoy doing this so much every year. The food is great, but the camaraderie and the guys, they're so nice. And, you know, it's great to have conversation. Well, doctor, we know you're a professional, but can you cook? Excellent. Well, that's how I got my wife. <laughs> what did you cook special today? Today I did a crusted macaroni and cheese with smoked ham. Chef, does this hat formation help with the cooking? It does. It offers a lot of swag with the with the food. I put my soul and swag into the food. That's how it comes out with the hat. That's how you do it. Well, do it you've the done hat. it well. Now, what have you created and what makes it special? I have created. I took my mom's macaroni and cheese recipe. I kind of tweaked it a little bit. I've added about six cheeses to it. It's super cheesy. What's the name of it? It's just mac and cheese, but it's my mac and cheese. Why are all the women coming to your table? Because I aim to please and not tease. They call me the oatmeal guru. Um, I satisfy the needs of women. That, um, I bake my cookies from scratch every day like grandmama used to do, only I did. That's why the women come to see me. What's the secret ingredient? The secret ingredient is uh, taking a blend of everything that the woman desires, you know, the freshest of fruits, the freshest of oils, and blending it and giving them the taste that they so desire. All right, well, let me see. Mm. I need to find me a woman. <laughs> well, we're here with the good-looking guys. Who are we with? Yo, noobs! Yo! Yo, Yo noobs! Yo! Yo! Pretty boy noobs! Yo! Yo! Well, that's exactly who we're with. Tell us about the station today. Well, what we have going on today, Con, is we're Stone Mountain Lithonia Alumni Chapter of Cap Alpha Psi, and this is our second shall we say, uh, migration with the gourmet gents. That's awesome. What did you cook? Tell us real quick. What's uh, it called? Spinach artichoke dip. Spaghetti with meat sauce. Crawfish and shrimp etouffee. Lady in red sweet and spicy chicken. Pigs in the blanket. Marshmallow mini cheesecake. Uh, I'm just oh, man, you forgot? <laughs> oh, man. All right, well, don't try his dish. But, guys, great job. Thanks for helping out the ladies. Right, Chef Anthony, what have you created today? Now, what we have is a uh, stone grits with some shrimp and a tarragon butter sauce. Now, after the women eat it, what are they going to be wanting to do? Oh, they're going to want to move and groove. Hey. What's the best part about cooking for the ladies? Looking at the ladies. <laughs> Chef Brion, what have you created? Uh, what I created was a blackened fish taco with a peach salsa and a tequila and lime coleslaw. When you put all of it in your mouth, happy, happy, happy. Chef Jason, what are you preparing on center stage? Man, I am preparing some really good stuff today. All the good food. That's why I'm on the center stage. All the amateurs are out there, but they have the best chef in the city on stage. It wouldn't be fair. We've had a great time here with the Coalition of 100 Black Women. Gourmet gents, we yeah. cook for the ladies, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Salad. I made salad. I was the only dude there that made salad of all the gourmet gents. We salute them for the awesome job they did. But I'm telling you, ladies, next year I'm bringing the red velvet cake. You've never had something so tasty and yummy. Bring it, ladies. I'm ready for you. 
Gourmet Gents next year, and we salute the 100 black women of Atlanta making a great difference. We'll be right back. Thank you so much for watching. Are you tired of negative news? We are. And that's why we're creating a movement. By keeping it real. With what you need to know. It's more than what's happening. It's bringing hope back to our lives. So go to ConTV.com and join our movement. <laughs>